after you have set up the composite portion, uh, next step is to just exit out the ACP and come back to the workbench. You want to hit update to update everything, and then now we want to set up the twist test. To do that, we will need the static structure. So pull that, drag that out from the list, and then place it on top of ACP pre. Oh, it didn't put it on there. Okay. Just to make sure all the information are transferred over. And then we will double click on the setup uh, to set up the uh, twist test. So this opens up the uh, ANSYS mechanical. So setting up the twist test is simple. So basically we want to keep the backside fixed and then apply a torque uh, on the front suspension so we're going to put like two opposite forces on those two vertex so to uh, set up to fix the back end we want to create a f fixed support so right click on static structures insert uh, fixed support uh, you can also get it from here from support list up here Okay, so we want uh, click on the edge. So you want to hit select this edge and this edge right here, and keep them fixed. And hit apply. And then now we want to apply the force. So we right click on static structure again. Insert force. Uh, we want to select the vertex. And apply, and then for the uh, the force vector, uh, let's do it using components. So click on the vector and select components instead. And so the force is going in the y direction. Let's put 500 pounds. No, let's do a thousand pounds. So it's going upward, and then we need to create another force that goes downwards on the other side. So right click static structure again, insert, force, and then select the vertex. Oh, where is it? It's right here. Hit apply. And then I uh, once again change the force vector to force component. And then for the y direction put negative one thousand pounds.